Taja Hall, hi guys, it's Janae, and welcome back to my channel. And today I'm gonna to be reacting to episode 10 of Spy X Family. I adore this show, I can't wait to see what happens in this episode. But before we do get into it, I just want to say a quick and massive thank you to all my amazing patrons and channel members. If you're interested in joining either of those for early access and uncut reactions, the links to it will be in the description below, along with my social media and my peer box. And if you want to subscribe, that's always greatly appreciated. But now, without further ado, let's get into today's video. Oh, okay. No, my soul. Was he literally. Time his teas. Mm hmm. Unfortunately. Well, it seems like his parents really aren't very present. Are we not going to get a photo of what he looks like? No pressure. Which is? Oh goodness. This is gonna turn into a disaster. I'm just assuming because we've like started off with this severe man who is so focused on elegance so I can only assume that this entire episode is going to be anything but elegant. Oh goodness. But can you receive a Stella while also already having a... I can't remember the name, but that bolt thing? Or like, do you have to have more Stellas to balance out the, the bolt? So like, if you get the a bolt and then you get a Stella, they cancel each other out and then you have to start again? Or can you just still get the points and... Ignore the, the the bolt. Oh, that's actually something she might be able to help with. Okay, but not the actual killer move, please. I th I mean, I feel like your has enough sense not to, but. Feel the need to say it still. You've seen her kick. <laughs> yeah. I'm trying to figure out what is she doing setups? <laughs> so cute. <laughs> Poor Anya. <laughs> I swear she has superpowers. I don't know how that ball remains solid through all that. 
からんがヨルさんに任せたことだしあもうえんうん、うん、うん、うん、うん、うん、うん、うん、アニアゴーお星さまいっぱいとって父の任務のお手伝い<笑> And she's like the only one who has the red band around the red 仲良くなると男満載何見てんだほらでもいじめてくるから嫌い<笑> the, the problem, the problem, the problem 兄貴と同じインペリアルスカラーにならないと出ないと Like, he really isn't a great person, but the thing is, he's so young, he could change if he just surrounded himself with the right people. I mean, do you feel bad for him? Because no kid should have that feeling. <laughs> Which hole are we part of? I say we. Anyway. Hello? Who are you, sir, with the glasses? Is that supposed to be Lloyd? Okay, show me who he is. Oh, okay, so you are the person with the glasses. Oh, Watkins, okay. Yeah. <laughs> Her, like, logic just bulldozing through them. But also, like, I'm assuming he isn't as massive as he seems. He's probably just a big kid compared to all the other kids. Yeah, there's no way he's a freaking their age with that voice. Who, who are you, random person? How old are they? They're six, right? What age is this man? Boy. Thing. Yeah, this is ridiculous, but we'll go with it because we saw your leveling trees as well. So clearly, there are some spectacularly gifted people in this series, shall we say. Daddy. Okay, yeah, so that's his. It's good to kind of get a, a perspective here. So he is still very small. Is it the guy with the scars? That's gonna be your biggest mistake. Are you sure about that? Ooh, we'll we'll just give them a pass. It's fine. Mm. <laughs> oh, I love it. I absolutely 
love it because it's kind of like it shows the the children's imagination and perspective in such a creative way and it also probably shows that even though the other kid the one with the very deep voice and the glasses it was probably quite intimidating and good with dodgeball he's probably also not quite what he's imagining himself to be <laughs> <laughs> oh, am I gonna cringe? Probably. So are you guys out? Why do, why does he keep on not hitting? I think all three of you are gonna be hit. Amy! That poor kid's nose is gonna be. Oh my word, so many people. Don't be too obvious. smile oh my soul is Damien gonna actually like block for her come on Didn't he? So it's literally just her against this guy. <laughs> I have faith in her though. Is that her, the name of her killer shot? Is that Arrow of Light? <laughs> this is not gonna happen, is it? I so badly want her to actually get this right, but... This is also a comedy. So, I'm just scared that they, they're gonna make her the punchline, where it's like, she's gonna look epic, and then she's gonna throw it. And it's just going to be another thing caught. <laughs> Come on, Anya, please. You can do this. Can she aim? That is the question. <laughs> oh no. That was what I was afraid of, damn it. Aww. <laughs> 
a set to. I'm so disappointed. I'm so disappointed. You landed a solid hit to Damien before because of her. I mean, we should have known that it wouldn't be that simple to get a Stella, but also it's just it kind of sucks. I think it would have been a real moral booster for Anya if she had actually won the game, but I suppose this is more realistic. I say after all the magic that they basically performed via imagination that was my favorite episode but i feel like it's good that we got a little bit of development in terms of damien's personality and also i even though i complained that they didn't show his older brother i feel like it's weirdly a good thing like kind of keeping him this mysterious force that's always better than damien and probably once we meet him it's gonna be like this is the guy, the guy that every con everyone can't stop talking about. He's just a normal kid. Uh, but we shall see, because I mean, in the same breath, we do have Yor and Twilight who are both exceptional. So maybe this kid is also Wonder Boy. But yeah, I don't know. It was very interesting. Again, not my favorite ep episode, but I did like the bonding between Yor and Anya throughout the training. That was fun. Um, and um, I like that they're kind of like showing different challenges that kind of are parts of what makes the whole. So anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed it as much as I did. And otherwise, I'll see you guys again next time. Zajin! <laughs>